and I'm back to that. I'm about ready to take on Ashlots here, so. Ashlot is a fighting style, um, I'd say kind of, uh, is closer to Astroth's as you can kind of see from her storyline here, um, she is not quite as strong as Astroth is or whatever, but, uh, she is a little faster, um, of course, uh, she has a bit more range because of, uh, uh, the actual spear that she uses, but, um, at least I think it's that kind of a spear, so it looks like a spear anyway to me, so, um, yeah, um, as you can see, uh, she's not human, so, which, uh, I kind of, uh, think is okay because, you know, out of all of the, uh, characters here in, uh, for your bonus people, um, you just don't seem to get as many chances to do your throw moves as you do with uh, your regular characters through the regular story. At least, uh, at least uh, th that's usually the way it is for me. So. Yeah, there's a uh, really not much that I can say about Ashlot. Um, as you can see, uh, she's got a really long storyline. I still think that uh, Yoda's one is a uh, is a bit more a uh, bit more um, long in the tooth than this one. Uh, almost kind of uh, too long, but you know, oh well. So let's see. I don't know if uh, she has anybody that comes with her. So. Yeah, those are probably her two best abilities, um, Guardbreaker and Knockdown, um, I think, uh, Shura, um, had Knockdown that was, uh, just not listed because, uh, in the fight that I did with her in the, uh, well, I guess, uh, previous video, um, she knocked down, uh, people a lot of times there, so, um, but, um, yeah, um, kind of makes up, uh, for her tad slow distance speed, um, faster than Astroth, as I said, but, uh, definitely not the, uh, fast character, so. Only those who have conquered fate have a place on the stage of history. Please, tell me who you are. So, you wish to test your strength. Stage start. Over here. Over here. Usually I do a little better with her, but I just noticed that I, when I got my level up the last time, um, 
I leveled up to level four, so um, I did lose the uh, first battle, and I just could not get anything to go off against like, Rock of all people. So, um, like all of her uh, Guardbreaker stuff would uh, just be blocked and wouldn't do anything. So, and of course, as soon as I attacked, um, he blocked it and uh, just go right away with that counter. So. Uh, it's kind of odd for him, but you know, oh well, so at least uh, I won the uh, second one here, so as you can see uh, she doesn't have a lot in the way of uh, points, so Well, that kind of is odd, um, the Nightmare Follows Tail Day. Um, if anything, it'd be, you'd think it'd be Sacred Nightmare, but... You know, oh well, so... Hopefully I can get a few things that actually, uh... Break their guard or whatever, but... <sighs> Knockdown really wasn't working out too well for me either, so... Countless warriors have cast themselves into battle for the Cursed Sword. Dirty hands cannot wipe away your tears. State your name if you have any honor. Stage start. Side. Battle. Fight. <laughs> I decided to go there for the actual win. Um, I was trying to get a soul crush to go off when, uh, when I noticed that uh, his life orb was uh, blinking right at the end there, but um, I decided to uh, actually go in and start trying to finish him off. And I'm actually kind of glad that I did because uh, if I kept going for the soul crush, uh, I just uh, would have ran out on time, so. Okay. Let's keep the fire pillar here. I thought that uh, Lizard Man was actually going to leave me, but. Uh, see who's this one going to be, so. 
Lord Shara's out, okay. Uh, yeah, not too bad of uh, stuff here, so. Um, of course, um, the thing to worry about with uh, Shara's out, uh, excuse me, is that, um, she is quite a bit faster than Ashrod is, so. A formidable opponent awaits. I don't care who you are. I'll take you on. Don't resist, and I promise I'll make it quick. Stage start. Over here! Ring out! <laughs> Stage completed! You should rest for a while. Uh, that was classic. Um, do pretty well for points with her. Um, not quite as well as I would do with a Charizard or anything like that, but or sorry, sure of but well, I guess Sherazad too, but um, yeah, um, I guess um, with this one, um, really, uh, the best thing to do would uh, to be get ring out because um, even though it said uh, equipment destruction bonus, um, you can't really uh, break any um, armor with uh, the bonus characters here in the. Uh, Usually third battle or so. <coughs> okay, Ashroth is gonna be Okay, the third one, so You would kinda think that uh the actual ink guy here for her would uh would be Ashroth, but um I don't know what it is, but uh, it has to be um, Siegfried, Nightmare, or Alcohol, I think, in this game, so. Which uh, is kind of weird. Um, you would think that the actual uh, person that they were going after would be, uh, be the last person, but, you know, oh well, so. Determination, obsession, hope. The fiery emotions illuminate the two swords. Poor thing! Stage start! <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, well. I'm well, surprised that I did so well with Lizard Band in that one, so. I guess I'm uh, getting a little more used to uh, his actual fighting style, so. Uh, let's see. I think uh, the in guy for her should uh, should probably be Uncle, like uh, all the other bonus characters, but see if uh, Lizard Man actually decides to stay with me. Okay, uh -huh. Okay, so I'll go. Guess I shouldn't be uh, really surprised or anything, but... Uh, let's see, um... Usually I do not have, um, extreme difficult with the Elgo with that, with the Ashlot here, but... Then again, I've been uh, kind of wrong so far with my view, also. Um, yeah, let's, uh, let's keep going here, so. The curtain has been raised. Those chosen by history begin their final battle. I will battle. destroy any that stand in my way. <laughs> Stage start. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of wonder if I should have uh, switched to um, Lizard Man uh, for the last couple of hits, but um, yeah, at least I was able to go through the first time through, so. Um, so much for uh, Guard Breaker and Knockdown and stuff like that. Um, it really didn't break a whole bunch of equipment for uh, my enemies here, so. Which is kind of a. Uh, Kind of a disappointment, I think, because uh, usually um, she has a lot of impact with that. Uh, I'm, I'm guessing you could call it a spear or a cross the air or whatever. So, um, yeah, let's uh, see what her ending is. So, as I said, um. Her main goal was to uh, actually take out um, Astroth, um, and I, I really don't know why she uh, she ended with uh, Alcohol or whatever, but because uh, of course Alcohol was uh, her main goal, so yeah. I hope she didn't have to go too far drinking around uh, Astra's body, but... Hmm. Not a bad ending or anything, but uh... Definitely uh, not as good as like a uh, Talium or... Even nightmare for that for ma for that matter, uh, but wonder why the cult actually disappeared. I wonder uh, if they uh, had like a suicide pact or something like that. So, um. But, uh, what I will do is, uh, I will meet you at the character select train because I am also going to be doing Sherazad in this episode, so 
Um, I will be right back. 